Hey everyone, welcome back. Here we are, new day, new lure. And uh, today we're just gonna do a, uh, a, pr a pretty simple pattern. It's called Northern Secret. Again, not my pattern. This is actually a, a mega bass pattern. And I'll include a, a link below as to where you can find this if you wanna shop online. Um, I just wanna try painting it. I think we can go through this one pretty quick. It looks like a good pattern. I, I like all the colors in it. it. Looks pretty productive. So what we'll do is we'll start with some chartreuse in the brush. And just along the belly. Put some heat on there and on to the next color. Next we have some pearl electric purple. Uh, I was going to go for a transparent color, like a flat out transparent color, but I kind of want some of that metallic, that metallic look. I feel like Mega Bass does a good job with metallics and uh, I, th I think we'll try that in the brush. Just along the back of the tail, we go light. Drag it up the body a little bit. Uh, I did reduce this with just a couple of drops. Maybe 20 to 1? Not, not a lot. I'll bring it up to the shoulder area. Now, I do need to point out that I haven't actually seen this pattern in real life. I'm just going based on the pictures. I don't have a lot of access to the Mega Bass, uh, Mega Bass lures, but uh, they did seem to note that there's this bit of a clear spot right in the middle there. So we'll try and keep that. Next, we have some carbon black. We'll lay this down on the head in about halfway down the back. We're gonna turn the pressure down to about 10. Uh, Cause I do wanna be kind of selective as to where this goes. I didn't have uh, like a bronze color, so we're gonna use some um, actress gold, metallic light brown, and some green gold. So I've used 20 drops, two drops, two drops. That created this little slurry right here. Let's open that up to give that a little stir again. 
I'm thinking the uh, the actress golden metallic probably have like different different size flakes in them or something that doesn't quite mix together too well in the cup. But when you drag it up the side, you kind of get an idea of what it's going to look like when it's laid down. So we'll get that in the brush and see if we like it. This is a great reason to heat dry, heat dry the lure. Because if you don't like it, it's a lot easier to wipe off without messing up your bottom layers. So starting at the tail end. So far, pretty good. bring it up onto that black a little bit because then you'll start to see a bit of a difference yeah, that's a better angle of how that bronzy color actually lays down from the black to just the regular clearish little bit of purple so I really like how when you angle it sideways you can see the brown come through and as you turn it more you go through the actress gold green gold really like that okay last color let's get some blue in the brush switched up my plan and went with the uh, metallic blue and just cover the black try to fade it the best you can into the other colors Okay, let's work on some eyes. So it wasn't part of the initial plan, but I'm having a lot of fun painting these uh, Mega Bass colors, and I thought maybe we'll make our own pattern in a, in a Mega Bass style. I don't know exactly what the plan is, but I know for sure, black. So black in the brush, modeled stencil on, Some actress gold. So we got the gold on over top of the black. And you can kind of see as I turn it, you can see the little black model come through. 
Very neat. Okay, next color. Okay, we'll use some pearl electric purple. Black back in the brush. Go straight down the back. I think we'll try and do like a, a a bluegill, but like a dark bluegill. So I like I like the black, I like the gold. The purple is a little bit of a of an accent, which I think we'll do another accent color after. Um, but yeah, I, I like the darker. What's well, in the darker? So it didn't go too heavy. Let's see what that came out with. With some metallic light brown. We'll just go a little bit down the back. some green gold some metallic burnt orange We use a bit of teal as our highlight. Just behind that back gill plate there. Sorry, I should turn it. Add some eyes. Let's use the same eyes we used for the other lure. Got a bit of cleanup work there. All right, and here's our two lures. We have the Mega Bass Northern Secret, link below, and um, Shadow Gill. Shadow Shadow Gill. Let's go with Shadow Gill. If you can think of a better name, put it down below. I'd love to hear it. And uh, can't take these fish in this week, but you know what? Thank you so much for watching. Please like, please subscribe if you got any value out of this. And uh, as always, have a great weekend.